Mr. Math here, thanks for watching my videos. Be sure to like and subscribe and remember to click the bell icon to be notified of updates. Hello again viewers, welcome back to Let's Play. Dino Blade Chronicles 2. I like your attitude. Judgment! Get back! Cyclone smash! Just the ticket! Ah! Uh, I'll take you easy to get back! Clean! 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 Treasure chest there. Is there anything in here? Hmm. Can't seem to open the door. At any rate, we're here in Theoscadia Palace, going down into the basement to try to save Pyra and Mithra. This is for a just cause. Who are about to be destroyed. Allegedly to save the world, although Zeke seems to believe differently. So we could fight those guys. But as you can see, we were this able to just sneak just around behind them. Alright. So yeah, we can just ignore them. And we're right here at the end. Come on, everyone, join me. There we go. Yeah, should I stick with this group? Hmm. It is a little bit risky not having a healer. If the worst happens, though, I'll just reload. So, sure. Let's go for it. Two fighters, one tank, more damage. Hopefully that will mitigate the lack of healing. Where? Strung up in some kind of restraint. Look ahead. Uh. An ether accelerator. I've seen one like it before in old Torna. It certainly seems like they want us gone for good. So, if we crank up the output and really focused it, we could probably manage one strike. If the people here really are the descendants of the Tornans, then I have a message for them that I must pass on. In that case, I'll leave it to you. Thank you, Mithra. He's here. I apologize for this, noble Aegis. I have no personal grievance with you. However, for the sake of this world, you must be destroyed where you stand. Is that truly your desire, your majesty? I believe you desired the same thing yourself, once. Is that not why you disappeared from history? Along with Adam the hero? <laughs> Begin. And there it gets laid out. He says it quite bluntly. Pyra! And she doesn't what? deny it. The Ether Accelerator! The what now? It's a weapon from long ago, designed to use Genbu's Ether energy for destruction. I never dreamed they'd fully restore it. My old man, he's gonna use it to kill Pyra. No matter how strong she is, there'd be no coming back from that. In that case, we can't let him use it. 
cutscenes, he still has Pyra's sword. Even though she's not in the Engaging the enemy! Right. 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 Oh man, he's almost gone. Help? But how? You better than this. You better than this. You better than this. You better than this. You Okay. That was close, but we still got it. Not having healer really made that a bit tough. Ah, there's too many of them. Hurry, or pirates toast! I know that! It's just... Forgive me. Damn it! Pyra! I won't let you! It's not enough! Poppy! Activate QT mode! Lift up from below! Understood, Master Pyra! They just blow the Titan's brains out? Would they have done that even if it had hit Pyra? They did it, Rex! They stopped it! Yeah! Pyra! Five hundred years. For 500 years, we Tantalese have concealed the Omega Fetter. Do you know why? Um. Our old homeland, Torna, was destroyed in the Aegis War. Our hero, Adam, also failed to return. You must understand, old Torna as a country was united around the hero. But, our ancestors less so. What are you saying? That we're not Adam's bloodline? Precisely. In Torna, our family were just a cadet branch. We only gained our current position in the confusion of the war's aftermath. But then, we're just a bunch of usurpers! They were desperate times. We had no choice. The nation must continue at all costs. Even if it meant claiming Adam's name. With its guiding force gone, much blood was spilled in Torna. We did what had to be done to reunite it under the new banner of Tanta. Legends of the hero who saved the world are deeply ingrained in people's hearts. And you used them for your own political agenda. Even so, all was done 
in the name of saving the world from burning once more. Don't you dare try and sugarcoat it. Short story is, they saw an opportunity to gain influence and they took it. Gah! That is the way of the world. Moradain could easily take a similar path. What does that have to do yes. with the Aegis? We are though? in no position to condemn them outright. So did this Adam guy really never return? Indeed. The records indicate he went missing immediately after sealing away the Aegis. It is likely he simply perished during the journey home. He didn't just go missing. What did you say? Aegis? Adam. He had foreseen everything. He knew what would happen to the people after the kingdom fell. But he chose not to return. Adam left us of his own will. But why? Hear me, my science. I am Adam Origo. This day I seal the Aegis, away from the world. But this seal is not for eternity. In anticipation of the day that humanity becomes worthy of the Aegis's power, I entrust her to posterity. She is our hope. When mankind has matured and learned to live better lives, she will answer your call and return to you. Trusting that day will come, I leave my final wish to you. Adam foresaw much confusion and hardship in the world ahead. And when I seemed unsure, he told me something. This is a trial. Is me sleeping a part of the trial? That's right. It is a trial for us humans, one we must overcome ourselves. If we cannot do that, we don't deserve to live alongside you. Interesting little piece of continuity there that I'll get to in a moment. Live alongside. To be honest, I still don't fully understand what he meant by that. Whether he simply meant the coexistence of humans and blades, or something more. But I think he made a difficult choice. For the sake of everyone's survival. Your Majesty! What is this? It's Genbu! It's broken free of our control and started to dive into the clouds. What? Are you certain? <laughs> Pandy! Oh! Oh no! What exactly is happening? Could it be that blast? What is he? Tantal keeps Genbu under control using the Omega Fetter. But firing the Ether Accelerator, it could have created a counterflow in Genbu's Ether Conduits, causing a critical overload. Or it could have just blown so his Genbu's brain out. Broken. Oh no! My words can't reach him anymore! Genbu is just going to dive deeper and deeper. Then. Domo, git! That's what happens when you use antiquated parts. <laughs> the cloud sea has a similar density to water. 
As we dive, the pressure will keep building. By 500 pets, a human would be crushed completely. And all that force will weigh down on Genbu? What's our depth now? 2,200 pets, sir. We are diving at a rate of 120 pets per minute. And Genbu's depth limit? 25,000, give or take. That'll give us just over three hours. Oh, Shell, it's good at maths. Bite me. <laughs> this ain't good. Hey, chum, there's a pressure resistant pod in the palace's southern tower. You guys at least should get in and escape. What about you and everyone else? Don't worry about us. How can I possibly not worry about you? Isn't there any other way? Some way to save everyone? Only Pandoria can tell Genbu what to do. If it won't budge for her, it's no use. Apart from that, all we can do is try to evacuate as many people as we can. But with just three hours. I think you mentioned before, you control Genbu using the Omega Feather, right? Uh, yeah, but... Where is it? Inside Genbu's head. It's straight south from the palace, through Genbu's spinal column. I will go. You'll go? Pyra, what are you... The Omega Feta is originally Ophion's control core. And Ophion is my artifice. It can't be 100% sure, but I think I might be able to fix it. Pyra? Pyra being serious? They tried to kill Pyra one minute ago? That's a totally separate issue. Isn't that what you'd say, Rex? What? Oh, yeah. I guess it is. And that's why. Friend Pyra. Tora get it. Then Tora and Poppy also lend help. Looks like we're in too, Drumak. I would have it no other way. That's settled then. Stay out of our way, old man. Got it? You would all risk your lives for this. For the sake of Tantal, though we attempted to destroy the Aegis. It's not about Tantal. Then why? You're a king, right? You ought to be able to figure it out. Rex, you are... Morag? You leave me little choice. Zeke, where was the fetter again? How do we get there? I won't just tell you. I'll take you right to it. Zeke? Save it, old man. You better make a start on evacuating the people. Though with us on the case, your efforts are probably going to be wasted. Understood. No time for chit-chat. Let's go. Yeah. Finally, someone mentions the king's duty to the people. That always seems to slip under the rug. Now, the path to the Omega Fetter isn't an easy one. This city, city Theoswar, is positioned a long way above the Genbu Drifts. If you head out of the palace and down to the left, you'll see the ruins of a place called Theospidi Temple. Or is that Theospidi? Uh, I don't know. Ruins, even though inside city. Yep, they really are ruined too, practically rotted away. Anyway, past the temple ruins is something called the Theoswar Rear Gate. We'll head out, we head out through there. Then we have to follow the pillars a long way down. Uh, sounds like a pain in the ass of a journey. But must be quick, quick. Come on, friends, to Genbu Drifts. Hey, I'm not done yet. Once we get to Genbu Drifts, we have to head across it. That gets us to a place called the Great Pillar Passage. The Omega Fetters at the end of that. 
Sound too long. Tora already getting tired just listening. Too soon for getting tired, Master Pawn. This is no time for joking around, Tora. We have to give this our all to protect Zeke's home. Of course. Right. Let's all do what we can. Thanks, guys. I owe you big time. So first, we head out of here and to the left. Got that? Tora, remember, just fine. Let's see. Yeah, I definitely want Nia back in the group. Or, well, against that many enemies at once, it would have been helpful to have her. But just regular enemies out on the map? Eh. Well, let's see what how it goes first. Now, the interesting bit of continuity I mentioned earlier was regarding the earrings that Pyra's wearing. I'm... I believe... I, I might get... I might be getting this backwards, but I believe that just now, when she showed that video message from Adam, she took off her right earring. And that's what held the message. Way earlier in the game, when we were helping Tora finish Poppy, she offered to sell her earring, and she took off the left one and offered that. So, a tiny little detail that... You know, while I was doing all of my test playing, I suddenly noticed it one day that you know, when I got to the uh, help finish Poppy part... Again, I was like, hey, wait a minute. That earring, is that the same earring she used to show the message? If she sold the earring to help pay for Poppy. But no, it wasn't. <laughs> they actually thought of that. They really paid attention to the details here. Let's see, how is she doing? Auto attack, really high. Critical rate, decent. So I don't think I need to give her a new core chip. Ooh. That's a good jump and auto attack. But it would be an abysmal critical raid. Hmm. Alright, so we have Pyra back at any rate. And Mithra, therefore. Let's see. It sounds fun. Okay, let's put her in the front. Hmm. So what? What um, elements do I have? So I have fire and light and earth and wind. Ice, lightning, fire. Fire, dark, and light. Hmm. Okay, so I'd have... Does anyone have water? No, I don't have water. That's a pretty basic one to be missing. Okay, let's switch Corvin for Aegean. Hello there. There we go. So now I have fire and water and light and dark and earth and electric and ice and wind. So I have all eight elements. Accessories. Whoa, what the? Okay, that could possibly explain why it didn't seem to be going so well. Okay, let's give Rex some accessories. Wow. Let's 
Let's give him Taurus Steam Belt. And then... More interested in dexterity for Rex. But the I think that's the only dexterity accessory I've got. Oh no, I have a I have a slightly better one. Okay, well, let's see. What can I give him that improves his attack power? Improves attack. Increases damage dealt to higher level enemies. We're pretty high level, so we aren't going to find many higher level enemies. At least not ones that are possible to beat. Okay, how about improved critical? Iron headband improves critical damage by 30. All right, let's give him that. All right, everyone else in the party is set. You guys are the worst. Doctors say it'll take me ten days to recover from your attacks. My apologies, she says with dry sarcasm. <laughs> kidding, kidding. There's no hard feelings, really. I should have been made of stronger stuff. Yeah, I'm actually rather embarrassed for myself, so confident that you could never take me on. But at least now I know my weakness so I can adjust my training regimen to compensate like a good soldier. Alright, at least he's cool about it. Down here, I do believe. Yep. Only the Prince's Blade can control Gembu's course and bearing. It was meant to stay submerged for as long as it was safe, but I have to wonder if something's happened to the Omega Fetter. Ah, but listen to me, Blab. We shouldn't be dithering away. We shouldn't be here dithering while the evacuation is underway. So, Zeke said we have three hours to get down to the Omega Fetter. It is literally impossible to make it within three game hours. People have tried. It is literally not possible. Three regular hours? Yeah. But not three game hours. And arrived. Oh, this is where we were going. Snowmound. Fire, guide me. I call upon the power of fire. The wind is my mate. Hmm. So I need more fire and wind. No, not there. there. Mm. Okay. No, not water, damn. Not water. Wind. Where's the wind? There it is. Wait, she doesn't have anyone with wind mastery? Really? Well, she doesn't have anyone who's wind element at all. Wacky. Alright, well he does. Wind level three. You can count on me. So that's level four wind mastery. That's, that's very six. kind of me. 
Okay, so now I need a bit more fire mastery. Everyone here is just level one. I think that should still be enough. That's very kind of you. Fire, guide me. How would you rate that? I call upon the power of fire. How would you rate that? The wind is my mate. Leave this to me. That was kind of ridiculous. If I may. But hey, I got it. This is for a just cause. Nothing else here. Okay, Lucarian, what's up? No, 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 where could it be? Something wrong? Ah, hiya. Have you seen a rock shaped like a turtle anywhere? It's only little. I dropped it someplace when I was playing outside the city yesterday. I looked and looked and looked, but I couldn't find it anywhere. The stupid snow probably buried it by now. If I don't find it soon, even more snow will fall and it'll be lost forever. Hmm, this is awkward. What should we do? Um, so, like, um, my dad gave me that stone. Said it helped me grow up big and strong. That was before he left. Mom said he went a really super long way away. But I'm not lonely. At least I wasn't when I had my turtle stone to remind me of him. I wonder if Mr. Turtle is alright. I hope he's not lonely. I gotta find him soon. We will help you out, sure. You'll help? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm going to keep looking around here a bit longer, so you go check around near Amfort Pillar, okay? It was I was over there yesterday, so I might have dropped it then. Okay. And of course, he's staying here where it isn't, and I have to go over to where it is. Let's see. There are a few places I want to get to now. Okay. Here's them for a pillar, not too far away. Oh, let's... Let's, um... Get our team back. What? Okay, uh, I forgot to select the one on the left that I need to replace. Um. Okay, make way for me. Who was the other one I had out? Was it Perun? Don't let me get rusty. I think it was, yes, all right. And then... Wolfric. It sounds fun. All right, there we go. While I'm doing side quests, I think Ursula is not the right blade to have out. Yeah, because she doesn't use trust for any of her things. So before I end this side quest, I want to switch to Korra to get her a bit more trust. I think that's the way to go. And by the way, Vess, you work with trust, don't you? Yes, you do. Excellent. Okay. So I have to remember to pull out Korra. Level 40, level 41. Looks like it's going to be up there, apparently. And there's a unique monster with a blade. These wolves don't seem inclined to give me any trouble. Probably smart. Hey! And 
and up we go. Ah, that's what we're looking for. Ah, I spotted something. Perhaps it's that child's lost item. Um, hey. Did that thieving grass pipido just make off with the item? If that's what he was looking for, well, then we must make haste. Uh, level 42, eh? Hmm. I could take him, I'm sure. Even with that blade backing him up. Although he's right next to the edge. I don't like that. Now let's see. In my experience... I wonder if I can pull him back from the edge. A little bit. This is kind of a precarious place to fight in general. Come on back. We will forge a path oh, and yeah. nine smash all the enemy's attention. Got it well in hand. No effect. Oh, rolling smash. Armor failed. Waited for this all day. Oh, I'm here. Why not? Judgment. Wolf ring. Yeah. Ready to unleash the blade. Yeah. 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 Launch him! Okay, Not Rock. Do level three. Okay. Not bad at all. Why not? Righto! Over my dead body. Much appreciated. Where are they? And you can do it, Rex. Roger. Haroon. I'm here. Okay, we're up on a ledge where they can't get to. <laughs> Why is Perun still out? What just happened? Okay, seriously, how are they attacking me? Ah. Uh, forget this. Raise B.
Oh well. I'm not going to complain. Without a healer, I still managed to take the unique monster. Now, let's see about all these things. This power is for us all. Doing pretty good. Nearing level three. Incredible power. Nearing level three. Nearing level five for Dagus. to go. Looks like up over that way. I could have sworn in my experience. Let's see here. We ought to be able to just fall right down. Fire, guide me. I call upon the power of fire. The wind is my mate. Oh, for goodness sake. What's it going to take to get his wind mastery up? Defeat an Illumi Skeeter in Araya. Hmm. Illumi Skeeter. Where are those? Hmm. If I go back to Araya and just defeat three more of them, I'll finally get wind level two. Still wouldn't be good enough for this. But, can make it easier in the future. You can count on me. Fire, guide me. I call upon the power of fire. The wind is my mate. Leave this to me. Aha. How do I get back up? I know how. I skip traveling. The Aswar rear gate. We've arrived. Where do we go from here? There's the boy. Now let's switch Ursula for Cora before I forget. Been a long time coming. Always cute and fierce, though. And also, rock for someone else. Uh, I'm not sure who, though. Hmm. Maybe I should bring in Percival. He's getting almost nothing lately. Back to battle. Got it. I give you my all. Let's see how that does. Yeah, he definitely, Percival definitely needs more trust. And so does Gorg. Boy, I've had Percival for most of the game, and he's behind Gorg, who I only just got. <laughs> yeah, I'll leave him in to get this trust from the side quest. Here you go. Wow, you found it. You really found it. Yay! I had no idea what I was going to do without it. Thank you so much. Very good. 
Here, take this. Hee <laughs> hee. It's nice, right? I love these. When I grow up, I'm going to be a cool helper outer person too. Hey, I challenge you to a snowball fight next time we meet. Helper outer people have snowball fights? Okay, if you say so. You retrieved the charm from the grass pepito and gave it back to Lucarian. Modern metal. Ooh, level five for Pyra. Unfortunately, that was it. That's what you get if you keep at it. I'm not done polishing my skills yet. Okay, so she's got level three focus. Boy, I haven't done any of this. Huh. Still doesn't tell me what this is. Closer. Yeah, I need to have Percival out more often. I don't know, he just looks cool. It feels kind of weird to have a tank blade equipped on Rex, but still. On the other hand, it feels even weirder to have a healer blade equipped on Rex. Brock, pleased to meet you. All right, that should do for now. And then I don't need two electric blades on the same person. Let's go back to Ursula. I won't let you down. I hope, at least. Right then. I could have sworn. And there was a treasure trove over here on that ledge right there. I was trying to get away from these blasted vaults. Very well. What? Shall we dance? Seriously? Rolling smash! Oh, now! Judgment! Rolling Okay. 
Oh, this is getting ridiculous. Oh, this is getting ridiculous. Yeah. combo completed. I got a little bit harrowing. Once again, lots of little enemies. I could have sworn. Lots of little enemies managed to nearly overwhelm us because we didn't have a healer. My usefulness has increased. Right. Yeah, I'm starting to think I should just bring Nia back in. I mean, in theory, I can get by I without a healer. Sworn, in my experience. But when there's so many enemies that surround me like that. This is for a just cause. Jeez, everything fell down here. What was I thinking? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my fail. In I go. My excitement is rising. Yeah. Get up! One big Yes! For sure! Get Let me do it! I've waited for this all day! Bittersweet dreams! Alright. Why did those guys attack us and not that one that's left there? Now let's the remainder, see. as you Flora might say. heals an aching soul. Let's see. There it is. Hmm. I'm gonna need wind mastery, it looks like. How much wind mastery, though? Is that all? Wait, Power Earth mastery? Engaged. All right then. Earth mastery. All right, Wolfric, come on out, please. It sounds fun. Earth. Grant me strength. That seems kind of weird. Earth mastery. If you're flying through the air, wouldn't that be air mastery? But, you know, whatever. There it is. I remembered there was something up here. Good 
Get over here. It's too early to be complacent. Let's keep our heads in the game. Judgment! No. I've got it well in hand. My incredible power knows no bounds. All right. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna bring Nia back in. The question is who to replace. Actually... I'm tempted to bring Tora back in also. He's getting behind in levels. But two tanks? That's not very useful. Also, we want Mithra to be the default. Alright, so, yeah. Zeke's leveling up pretty quickly. Let's send him to the bench. Give the others a chance to level up. Alright, let's see how we're doing here. I am going to replace Gorg with Rock. Because I'm currently missing Rock. a wind element. Pleased to meet you. Alright, so I have fire and water, and I have light and dark. And I have wind and ice, and I have electric and earth. I'm good to go. Boy, that was close. I nearly went right over the edge. Okay, I need to go down there. Let's end this sweat, my excitement. Great, yeah. Yeah. And just because I feel like it. Let me do it. I'm waiting for this all day. Rolling Enemy will be consumed. Rolling smash. Damn it. One tail switch. So far, so good. This thing gonna aggro on me? You know what? I'm not even gonna wonder. Let's end this swiftly. Let's just take it. Let's, let's just take it out. Game. Okay. The way it's just the way it's walking away is kind of irritating. There we go. Engaging the enemy! Rolling smash! Judgment! Rolling smash! Turn this in our favor! Yeah. Let me do it! Make I'm going to do this all day! Unleash the blade! Why not? Rolling smash! Judgment! Ha! Let me do it! Let me do it! Ha! I'm waiting for this all day! Take it easy, Mr. Tiger! Wolfric, right. you need to eat a dumpling and calm down. But I am not angry. <laughs> yeah, Vess and people misjudging Wolfric.
<laughs> Engaging the enemy. Let's show everyone why they call you Flame Break. Excitement is rising. Rolling smash. Pop the tire to defend is now. Rolling smash. Fuck it. Any Why not? Quick one and one. It finished that. No mercy from me. Get with me. No offense. Take this light Burn out. Burn out. That was over a hundred thousand damage. Just wow. that gap far off in the distance I want I think I want to try to get across that I think now let's see now this part this just first time I came here it took me forever to figure this out I wasn't sure that I was going the right way if this thing looked like it was supposed to fall because, you know, the bridge is out, so I needed to make a new bridge. It took me forever to figure out that I could make that part, part of the floor crumble. And now... So there's my bridge. Heals an aching soul. Doesn't seem like this would be a good place for botany, but eh, what do I know? I guess flowers can grow here. Yeah, I believe I want to go across that gap over there. I think. I could be wrong, but I think I want to go across there. The problem is exactly how to get up there. Hey, look what I found! Congratulations! Okay. Lots of enemies here. Evening is upon us, it seems. Fatigue is a silent killer. We had now better rest soon. See. In my experience. Bridget might have a point there. I'm feeling like it's getting close to stopping time. But I'm gonna go a little bit further. Yeah, it is not possible to get to the goal within three game hours. Three real hours? Probably. But three game hours? No. Because in the game, one minute passes in one real time second. So that means three hours passes in three minutes. It's simply not possible to make it that far in only three minutes. Speedrunners have tried. Feel like fighting that thing. Uh, okay, that looks like the direction I want to go.
question is, can I go up far enough to get there? Because the game, or the main quest rather, wants me to go down. I could have sworn... Flora heals an aching soul. Quest wants me to go down. But to get over to that gap that I want to try to get across, I need to go up. Mm. Yes, I definitely do want to go over there. How do I get up there? Well, this is looking a bit promising. Lots of bugs here. Um. We've been discovered. What? Oh, for the love of Rolling Smash! Judgment! Why not? Wrong! We're going to go. Wait for this. This is your match. Now. Great. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ah, I miss this is unexpected. What? Draw the enemy to Um Help? Heavy Blade! The enemy's Yeah, decisive blow. Yeah. 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 Quite ridiculous. Got it well in mind. I've waited for this all day. Now. May Judgment. I have the power? Sure. Oh. 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 Yeah, the time. Rolling smash. In I go. 
Wolf, yes. Wolf. got it well in hand. It's here. Roger. Wow. Oh, we got Bridges' fire mastery up finally. And yeah, that's right. She needed I to defeat Arachnos to here in Tantal, didn't she? That's what she wanted for it. Robin Ferris, eh? Discover a landmark. 140 total, 20 to go. Now how in the world do I get up there? I could have sworn, in my experience. Tunnel from somewhere over there. How do I get up there? I didn't see a way up earlier. It's all that down there. here and it'll lead me back up? I'm not sure I understand how this place is put together. Okay, the main quest wants me to go down. I don't want to do that yet. I won't follow the main quest. Wait a second, this might be the way. Now let's see. In my experience. Who are those guys? Garless. This might be the way. Oh, this might be the way. Arachnos. Eep. Hey, can one of you go eat the other one? That would be really helpful. The only one in the group who has a launch art is Mia. Launch, 
Wind smash. It did not connect. You're looking fine today, Rock. Thank you. I try. And yet you could teach me a thing or two. Ice headband. That's actually a good one. That is an accessory that is a better version of this iron headband that Rex has. Only slightly better. Rex has a legendary level iron headband, and this is just a rare level ice headband, so it's only an extra 35%, but any extra is helpful. Yeah, so that's the way I wanted to go. Collapsed Frozen Bridge. Stay frosty. Calm your mind. Focus. Structural analysis in progress. There. That should do it. So I need five more levels of ice mastery, do I? Yeep. Okay. Do I have that much? Ice mastery is something I've been trying to keep up, but... Level one, 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 and one. Ugh. Okay, well let's just go ahead and equip I'll shine them. on the front line too. What would you do without me? And then again, level one. Rock on. Level two. That should be good enough. Hey. Just in case hey. I put them both in. That should be enough now. I think I'll show you my power. Here's a little Just demonstration. Use my power! Use my power! Stay frosty. Calm your mind. Structural analysis in progress. There. That should do it. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Hello there. I wish I could share my luck with everyone. I won't let you down. I hope, Rock. at least. Please to meet. It you. sounds fun. There we go. Oh, actually, rather than Wolfric, I think I want Agate. Because Rex's Great Axe set has a launch art. I hope I'll live up to your expectations. His... His, um... Spear set has a break art, but his axe set has a launch art. And that's what we seem to be lacking here. And also, Agate needs a courtship upgrade. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. The Ladronite ship. What else? Uh, 466 and 20%. 444 and 32%. Let's go with the higher critical rate. Yeah, that was a huge upgrade for Agate. Okay. So Agate comes with a launch art on Rex. So now I both Nia and Rex I'm have a launch right. art. Oh, this is where we were going. That'll make driver combos a lot easier. Oh dear. These are crumble floors. Is this guy going to aggro on us while we're right next to this? See? It's a new day, everyone! Look alive!
Are these guys gonna aggro on us? This is a pretty precarious place to have a fight. Very well. Shall we done? There's more of them! Uh. We're... We're Great. not dead yet. Rolling smash excitement is rising. Yeah, we're on great. Any time. I'm waiting for this all day. You're not seen. Indeed. Yeah. My excitement is rising. We're on. Just with flames. I'm going to be the best. Sure. For sure. Sure. Bold tackle. Sure. Now. This is great. Yes. That's kind of the point. Bold tackle. It was inevitable, given the circumstances. What was that? Come on, stop wasting our time. All right. <laughs> Nia, you're being a bit hard on Mora there. Are you going to aggro on us? Probably. Are you going to come back this way? Like yes. Engaging the enemy. Lady Morag, be careful. Great. Judgment. Oh, oh, Quicken off. Let me do it. Not the right I use it. Why not? Excellent comfort. Rope, rock, and hair. Always have been. Always will. Watch this. Let's take them in one fell swoop. And... I think I want to keep going up, yes. It's too early to be complacent. My excitement is rising. I see the judgment. Probably would survive it, but I mean, I don't want to go down right now. I want to go up. Okay, we got a little camp here. Hmm. Okay, one of them's walking away. This might be my chance. Engaging the enemy. Hey, Morak, let's team up for this one. Brick! I judgment! Strong! Rolling smash! Yeah! Quick in art! Let me do it! Okay, the time to defend is now! I feel a thing that orcs ready to unleash the blade! The time is now! Sing the time is now! Let's see if it's only we can win this! Ha! Strong smash! Draw the enemy yeah. yeah. into decisive blow! Judgment! 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 
Take it easy, Mr. Oh, Tiger. Smash, smash! Our victory was inevitable, given the circumstances. We're all amazing! Okay, now Rex gets into the spirit of things. Unlike Nia. I could have sworn, in my experience. I know quite a bit. We've been discovered. All right, come on down. There's more of them. Rolling what? smash. The time to defend. Can I go? Come on, you be with now. Just keep ah. it. Got it. One big one. My Coming dead body. Got it. 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 It won't be that. Yeah. I won't have my enemy. Make your time. Let's take them at one fell. I've waited for this all day. Go away. The time to defend. I'm not sorry. Final. Together now. Give it to me. Excellent. don't call you the Empire's strongest blade for nothing. I am but a humble student of Lady Morag's greatness. Come now. Without Bridget by my side, I can hardly call myself a special inquisitor, can I? There's a treasure trove up there. Do I have to drop it there from above? Looks like the place to do that. Uh, no, I'm not close enough. Darn. All right. Well, I'll worry about that later. I don't believe I've ever been in this area in any of my test play. I could have sworn in my experience. I know quite a bit. not like bugs and believe it or not that thing was a bug doesn't really look like one that looks like a bug <laughs> Ice slide somewhere up here. Ooh, okay, a unique monster. Alright, viewers, I think this is the place to end the video. Because we've gone a fair distance, and I don't know that I have time to fight a unique monster. So, Thank you very much for watching this episode of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 2. In the next episode, we're going to continue climbing this pillar to try to get to that ice slide that I saw. I can't see it from here, but it's up there somewhere. Looks like I'm going to have to go through there to... Hey! Rude! 
Look, you can lift off and go away any time now. Thank you. Anyway. Now that Mr. Rude, who interrupted me, has gone away. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.